<laughs> okay, so uh, here we are with the further maths heroes, including Jordan. <laughs> was that what you wanted? Oh, sh <laughs> <laughs> Pretend that was unscripted. Um, okay, so your first mark for this one, I, I, we know what we're doing with this. First mark is for just multiplying out these brackets. So you're going to get r squared minus 1 out of that, as r goes from 1 to n. So there's one mark just for doing that. Now we need to split this up. So this would be the sum of the r squareds. Take away the sum of some 1s as r goes from 1 to n. And here we get the first mistake that people make. The sum of the r squareds is one that we know. That's the 1 sixth n, n plus 1, 2 n plus 1. That one's OK. This one is the one that we make a mistake with. Because if you add up a lot of 1s, if you do it n times, you get n, don't you? So we need to have to take away n at the end of that. Quite a few people had to take away 1. Um, now we need to, to do our fully factorised form a bit. We've got a common factor of n. We're going to take a sixth out as a common factor as well. So that gives us n plus 1, 2 n plus 1 there. And if we've taken out a sixth of n as a factor of that, then it's six that we need to have there in order to make it match up. A sixth of n times six is n. So we've got inside this one sixth of n, two n squared, what is this? Two n squared plus n plus another two n plus three n plus one minus six. So that would be a minus five. And then it's that thing that FP1 does of, of assuming that you can just do the bits that in form 1 are worth something. In FP1 it's just stuff you have to be able to do without thinking. So this is going to be, it must be 2 and n, doesn't it? And it must be 5 and the other one, 1. Um, so if the 5's there and 1's there, what have we got? Uh, is that going to be right? Plus five. Plus five. Yeah, plus 5 and minus 1. Yes. And there we've got it. Of course it doesn't matter. If you have these brackets the other way around, but there we go. They, they load those things with marks, so that's got to be a place where we, we're making sure we get lots of marks, isn't it? That was six marks for doing that. It does seem like a lot to me as well. But you've got to make sure that you get all of those marks. And that's maths. Don't be 